All right, what's happening right now? The brutal murder of Jeffrey Osborne and six year old Jacob Hall is something the upstate will never forget. Both were killed back in 2016 after Jeffrey Osborne's son, Jesse, shot him before opening fire at Townville Elementary, ultimately killing little Jacob. Jesse Osborne was just 14 at the time of that shooting. His sentencing hearing begins in less than 30 minutes now at 9 o'clock. Fox Carolina's Grace Runkle joins us live outside of the courthouse. Grace, what can you tell us? Yeah, Margaret, and the doors just opened at the Anderson Courthouse behind me. Like you said, we're just 30 minutes out from the start of that hearing. This is a special sentencing hearing, although Osborne already pleaded guilty to two counts of murder and three counts of attempted murder. This week, a judge is going to be looking at how much his age at the time of those crimes should factor into the sentencing. Again, he was just 14 years old back in 2016 when all this took place. Osborne is facing a minimum of 30 years behind bars for each of those counts of murder, and he could even even face up to life without parole. This week we are expecting a judge is going to be looking at some psychological reviews of Osborne. We already heard from several different psychologists during other hearings. For example, when they were trying to decide whether or not they should try Osborne as a juvenile or as an adult, and they had differing opinions. One said that he was sound of mind and the other said he did show some signs of psychological distress and maybe some disorder. So we're expecting to hear a lot more witnesses testifying about that this week. Week. Now, back in 2016, um, Osborne told investigators that he was angry after being bullied. That's what led him to go on the shooting. He, of course, killed his father before opening up shooting on a elementary school, and that's where he killed, shot and killed six-year-old Jacob Hall. You can see his picture here on the screen, and again, his first victim was his father. That was Jeffrey Osborne. He was 47 years old at the time. Like we said, things are about to start up here in Anderson County. We're going to be following this hearing all week, bringing you the latest. Margaret Ann.